The West Virginia Republican Party is the affiliate of the United States Republican Party in West Virginia. In 2018, Melody Potter was elected as state chairwoman to fill the unexpired term of Conrad Lucas, who resigned to run for office. Party platform The state party platform is similar to the national platform in that the party fervently supports the coal industry against Environmental Protection Agency, supports a patient's right to choose medical care in lieu of the Affordable Care Act mandates, the right to bear arms, advocates the parent's right to choose their child's education, and upholds traditional marriage, and the right to life. The party favors the elimination of personal property tax on equipment and machinery. It favors reducing gasoline tax and corporate net tax to the 6% national average. It also favors the Fair Tax Act. <laughs> party history The Republican Party arose in 1854. The Democratic Party was an advocate of slavery and the Republican Party opposed it. There was a lot of turmoil in Virginia with the rise of the Republican Party. When the Civil War reached Western Virginia, there was a rise in violence against those who opposed slavery. In May 1861, people traveled to Richmond, Virginia to vote on secession of the state. Many Republicans had to leave the city because of the threats. Those who fled and others who lived in western Virginia went to Wheeling to create their own government and began creating a new state, in which they were successful. The Civil War helped the Republican Party gain recognition in the state. The Civil War in West Virginia often split families apart. The Boggs family lived in Pendleton County and one son was the head of the Confederate County Court while another son was the head of the Union Home Guards in the North. Today, the northern party of Pendleton County is still strongly Republican. Republicans in Hampshire and Hardy counties left after the war to form Mineral and Grant counties, which are still primarily Republican. Republicans held the control in the state until the 1870s and the Confederates began voting and holding offices. In the 1870s, the party was so weak that it endorsed a Democratic governor. Major Nathan Goff Jr. restructured the party. He was able to get the party to raise money and voters and recruit leaders. He led the party until the 1880s. He ran for governor in 1888 and won. The Republicans were the dominant party until the Great Depression. Since the Depression, Democrats have controlled the state. Arch Moore Jr. was elected the Republican governor in the 1960s. In 1985, Moore helped raise money and supervised recovery efforts for the flood of 1985. The state voted for Bush in 2000 and 2004. Betty Ireland was also elected as Secretary of State in 2004. In the 2014 elections, the West Virginia Republican Party made major gains in West Virginia, capturing one of its two Senate seats, all of its Congressional House seats for the first time since 1921, and gained control of both the West Virginia House of Delegates and the West Virginia Senate for the first time in 80 years. In the 2016 elections, the Republicans held on to their seats and made gains in the state Senate and gained three statewide offices. Current elected officials The West Virginia Republican Party holds all three of the state's three U.S. House seats. Incumbent Governor Jim Justice who was elected as a Democrat in 2016, switched to the Republican Party in August 2017. State Governor, Jim Justice Attorney General, Patrick Morrissey Supreme Court Justice, Beth Walker Supreme Court Justice, Alan Lowry State Legislature President of the Senate, Lt. Governor, Mitch Carmichael Senate Majority Leader, Ryan Ferns Speaker of the House, Tim Armstead House Majority Leader, Daryl Cowlsfederlou, S. Senate Shelley Moore Capito U.S. House of Representatives David McKinley, 1st District Alex Mooney, 2nd District Evan Jenkins, 3rd District Topic. Party officers WVGOP officers Melody Potter, Chairwoman Roger Hanshaw, Associate Chairman 
Chris Warner, National Committeeman Michelle Wilshire, Treasurer Shirley Searles, Secretary Mark Carter, General Counsel Greg Smith, Vice Chairman, North Karen McCoy, Vice Chairman, South Kevin Poe, Vice Chairman, 1st Congressional Paul Hartling, Vice Chairman, 2nd Congressional Marshall Mann, Vice Chairman, 3rd Congressional Pam Krashansky, at large, 1st Congressional Jean Jacobs, at large, 2nd Congressional Julia Long, at large, 3rd Congressional Marty Sheehan, at large, statewide Louis Rexrode, at large, statewide Sarah Minear, at large, statewide Karen S. Evans, W.V. Federation of Republican Women Syed R. Actor, W.V. Federation of College Republicans Dusty Hoylman, W.V. Federation of Young Republicans <laughs>